I want you to meet the community leaders on supper time. Supper time is supposed to start with us. Not you, you're just a human. Add all the fat. That's the leader of the mob. That's Don the Don. Or you could call him Boots. Chester's here just in case he can get close enough to reach in and stick his hand in. <laughs> and, and Emily's back there. She has a piece of ham. She's fine. I don't know who's in the in the hall. But when we get the boys all fixed, hopefully it happens soon. He he doesn't he's fixed. Uh Chester's fixed. But we have three boys that need to be fixed. Tomorrow I hope to well I'm planning on going to Owain. Yeah, pick up papers. See if they'll give me papers. Otherwise, I have to go through the IRS. I want to be a legal and non-profit. I've been a non-profit, people think, all my life. A friend of mine, Harriet Duggan in Watcon, she used to say, Val, you'll never be rich. rich. You give everything away. You know what? In my own way, I've been rich forever. He says, I don't know. That sounds really, really sick. And here you're going to eat your food right in front of us. You eat your food in front of me on my lap. He says, you're telling tales out of school. I, I got this lovely bouquet for my birthday from Penny's mom. And I had it in a, in a container. And I did something I've never done before. In 65 years, took something out of the box so I can enjoy it before I die. I enjoy books all the time. Um, I still haven't found a book that I need that's going to Wisconsin. I've never sent a book to Wisconsin. This is the first. So I have that box to go through. And there's two boxes there. And a box in the back, not far from mom and dad, not far from dad. It's dad, dad's in the middle, and his older brother Norman Irving A. Eric Heike, and his sister Gertrude Heike Rohr. She married Charles Rohr and Waukesha. I sent my cousin a friend thing in in Alaska. I lost everybody when I came out. You know, my cousins were rebel rousers and drink the man who invented beer under the table. Very good Christians. Leave me tasting sour crap in my mouth, so I better not go on. So, anyway, I gotta eat my ravioli. Isn't that the best picture you've ever seen of him? He is such a pretty boy. And he has a bad ear, but it all healed up, and his place on his back healed up. He has cancer, but. But we're hoping that he doesn't. We're hoping that it was all figurement of someone's imagination. Because when he's not being bossy, he is so sweet. That's Lulu. She says, well, get to it. I'll be back when you get that can open. We got one can left. And then I'm hoping my bank account looks better tomorrow. But we're going to stretch like we do always. I have to get warm in medicine. Everybody's, nobody's pooping. Everybody's shitting. And I have diarrhea all over the place. And I don't want my babies to get sick. Babies get worms. So, and, and the lady at the vet said that I was right. You got to do it now. 
while they're little, get get rid of them so that they live. There's a, a table on top of that because, and like, I took the chair out. I had a chair in with a kitty uh, Motel 6 um, in the girls' room. It keeps it from falling down. When they fight and ride around in there, three times I have had to pick Precious and her little tiny babies out of the kitty house. No one got hurt, but it sure is startling. And once it landed on Ruth. That's why I have a table in there. The babies are so precious. I hope you all have a great day. Luck I am. A great weekend. I'm going to have my ravioli. It feels so nice and warm between my legs. <laughs> I don't really know who it could be unless it's the only ones out there. Is, there's just a few girls, but like Sophie is fixed. She's out there. Anyway, I hope you have fur people in your life because they make life so much better. And it'll be better when I don't have a big old black male cat spraying all over. I mean, he's such a, he's a nice kitty, and he's let me talk to him. Not Boots, uh, Lewis. But, you know, if we get him to stop doing that, that would be even better. Okay. I guess I'm done. Have a good night. Bye. Hey, Chester.